head tracking servo and like a, right. some of the fat sharks have it. Mm -hmm. Head tracking servo, they can look around at what they're doing. When I'm not important anymore. Hey guys, we oh, are nice. here at Sean's, well it's a bee farm actually, and uh, a bunch of other stuff. Um, and we're gonna fly and yeah. have a little fun day. And I'll show you a bunch of cool stuff. Hey, my name's Sean, and we're here at my shop, and we're all gonna shred some packs today and uh, try and keep most of the mud off of them. And maybe a little racing, a little freestyle. I'm a woodworker by profession, and we do nothing but custom woodwork here, and which is kind of and then got beehives out back. So uh, I have 30 beehives, and 15 of them right now are down in Florida. Okay, so. We've got all this area here, all this little thicket woods here is mine, and there's a trail that goes down the down the back side of it. I just trimmed it all up so it's probably 10 foot diameter all the way down through there. Um, that whole field over there is uh, totally ours to play in. This yard is ours, and then back over here there's probably 10 acres. It's all wide open field. To, uh, that we can play around in. Well, now since we've seen the property, uh, I'm gonna get out and rip some rip some packs. I'm sure they are too. Let's show you the whole thing. Do some stuff. Uh, good thing I brought my uh, beater drone, so cause I have that that trip coming up, so I can actually do some stuff and have some good fun. Let's see it. Yeah. Uh oh, something just flew. Oh shit. Is that me? Yeah, I think so. Shit. Sounds like a ship. Yeah, it's running real bad. Well, that was my fault. I plugged in my drone. I That's my favorite one too. Right in the power line. Oh, whip! That destroyed my battery. I bet it did, dude. <laughs> it's oh man. Man, that thing is thick. Oh, I thought you were going to hit your head. I was going to. <laughs> no! Thrown down! It's right over there. Oh, I thought it was going funnel. straight into his forehead. I thought you were going to catch it. <laughs> I was like, cool. catch it in his hood. Or <laughs> the motor and catch it, but then he just whoop, right over his head. I've gotten it that close, but not on purpose. Thanks for that. <laughs> I mean, look at my boy. He's looking at his wide eyes. Uh, you can't land this thing comfortably because it's so. There's the only center of gravity is the 3S battery, so you land and it just hits the ground outside. Yeah, it's terrible, but it's fun. I love this thing. <laughs> Freaking hunter, always sending it. Hey, hunter, I'm taking over your video. Uh, this is the search for Millie. Where is she at? We don't know. This is a hard time for us. Um, we don't know where Millie is. Oh. I crashed my stuff. I got blown out of the air by DJI. There was, so we're behind a metal building. There's two DJI quads. Uh, one was on, Hunter turned his on, and I was popping up over way too high than what I should have been flying next to DJI, and knocked me out of the air. But I think it's dry, it might explode, and if it does, I'll just build another. It's the moment of truth. Yeah, it is. Is she catching fire? Not yet. Yeah, right.
crazy. XM Plus, but I don't know, I'm getting a little bit of, like I don't want to go about any further than what I am. Oh, this isn't the centipede. Um, it's a part of the, you can just pretty much um, hit a button on the side, yeah. I guess. And then when you record on the centipede, the EIS will literally destroy your footage. Oh, really? Yep. Yep, so you can't run EIS on it at all. I'm just flipping around now because I'm too afraid to go out anywhere. This thing can probably run, I don't know, actually. Open it up 40, 45, uh, no, I guess I can. It's getting pretty cold outside, so we're, you know, taking a little break for a minute to, or whatever, warm up, so. But, Lee is in town, which is awesome. He uh, came back from Florida, so we're gonna talk to him. So how's Florida been? Paradise, man. Florida's great. It's amazing. Go to the beach every day. Ooh, you just smacked a puddle so hard. Woo! Number two of the day. Oh shit, you got your different shit, you got your new shit. <clears throat> what does this giant thing right here do? That's the extractor. It's a centrifuge that slings all the honey out. Really? Yeah, you scrape that top off of those and you put it in there and slings it all against the wall. So there really? Bees in here. There's no bees in here right now, right? <laughs> That's an important question. Really kind of tuned it to. So why are those black? Um, so this is made for honey. Mm -hmm. So that you can see how clear it looks. I really wish it was white. The black ones are for uh, the brood nest because they have the. Uh, it's dark and their their eggs are white, and mm -hmm. you can look in there and you can see them. <laughs> that's awesome. What's the gotcha. What's the brood mean on the boxes though? What's that? That's where they raise the baby bees. That's oh, all their, their okay. the brood nest is all the. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Baby yeah. Bees Probably some sci-fi stuff talking about the brood <laughs> nest and stuff, yeah. and that's exactly what it is. I didn't think I've ever been able to see something like this before. I have never seen anything like this yeah, before. This is pretty awesome. Like I'm, this is rock. You got bees. Up. That's cost. That's awesome. <clears throat> we'll come back in the, in the summer and uh, I'll put a bee what suit on. What does this thing do, Sean? Heck yeah. Well, and the, you put honey in there, but. Uh, so those are there. the eggs then, I'm guessing? That is where they were trying to make a new queen. Oh, There was what? an emergency. Trying to yeah, make a new queen? Yeah, these are cells that no, were trying to make a new queen and it failed. What do you mean trying to make a new queen? Like they didn't get it done. So like the breed, like whenever the baby bee comes out, it's pretty much made, hailed as the queen, mm -hmm. essentially, but they, 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 they can they, choose? They can, yeah, they turn her into a queen. What? what? No way. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. No way. That's so crazy. <laughs> I yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, she'd just be like any other ones. They, they'll they'll build these special cells and they'll turn her into a queen. They just pick one. That's insane. Crazy. How do they do that? That's crazy. Well, they're probably picky about it. You know. Sorry, go just just dig in there a little bit and just push your finger into it. There you go. That's good. Oh, no way. For real? Oh, absolutely. Dude, try that, Chai. Try that. That's delicious. Hunter's like, get out of my way. What? You want to try it, Chase? Try yeah. that. And that's straight from, wow. Mm -hmm. Wow. Now I try not to chew the wax up and get it all on my teeth. It drives me crazy. Unprocessed? Oh my yeah, God. Yeah, well the I bees. just came out of a bee's butt. <laughs> hey, damn, I just ate bee shit and that tastes amazing. Yeah, that was delicious, <laughs> that's dude. That's the best Freaking bee shit. Bomb. That's a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody else need seconds? So dude, I really want some, some more. Bee, some more bee poop. <laughs> Did you offer? This is seriously, Dude, this tastes idea. like candy. It's nectar, it's flower nectar, it's all of it. Ambrosia, nectar of the gods. I'm not gonna lie, that is really, really good. Wow. I put it around the rim of my beer. <laughs> <laughs> that wouldn't be a bad idea. Sounds like a good idea. I think it's raining too right now.